this record coming out, I am really curious what people will think. ideas of harmony and melody to percussion and different instruments that necessarily don't have a fixed pitch. Starter pistols or cannon uh, shots or wind machines or all these effects, you know, because we are uh, assigned the task of playing all these different types of instruments that necessarily don't have a home in the string family or the brass or woodwind family, um, you know, percussionists were the natural performers for those instruments. I think like anyone who composes, you just use your experiences and who you are as a person, what you've been exposed to, um, and that plays into what you're going to say. It's a dissemination of all those influences and things that you've done. So I guess having a lot of experience, you know, playing as a drummer in a rock band, that's that's going to play into what I do. Or, or playing experimental improv music, um, you know, that's going to play into what I write and what I compose. And for me, it's just about, you know, about being honest with myself. Yeah, I guess I'm not pretending to be, um, you know, a schooled composer. Uh, these people are asking me to write for them because they want something a little bit different. They want something that I have to say. So I always have to remember, just come back, bring it back to who I am as a person. My experiences draw from those things and I'll come up with something that's interesting to me, I'm sure, and, and honest. And I really didn't have any intentions of writing anything beyond uh, percussion music. Adventureland is definitely a document of what I've been doing since Mobile. And it was the first time I, I composed, um, you know, Mobile was still an all percussion record. It was all for percussion and I played all the parts. But after Mobile came out and groups started approaching me, um, it, you know, I was faced with this decision. Do I go down this road? And it seemed like it was, you know, exciting but scary at the same time. You know, initially it was just that here, here I am in this new venture, writing for other instruments, writing for a string quartet or mixed ensembles, chamber ensembles, pianos, all the stuff I'd never done before in my life. You know, I wasn't a composition major or anything like that. I was a percussion performance major. It was a, a new adventure for sure. You know, I was going to have to see if I had it in me, if it was something I could do, um, and had to figure out if I had something to say, if I had a valid voice. Uh, and so, yeah, it was, it was new territory. And, um, a bit daunting at first, but at the same time ended up being a lot of fun and interesting. For me as a, as a person and a musician, I've always needed that balance. I've been in a rock band since I was a kid, literally, always since then. And I've been playing in orchestra and band as well since I was a kid. So I've always had those both sides to my personality and, and they're, they just balance each other. With Wilco, it's I'm with five guys. Um, there's a lot of people around. It's, um, you know, it's a community. It's very collaborative where when I compose, it's, it's all me. It's more, you know, uh, plays on those hermetic tendencies that I have. You know, it's all you, it's a different set of challenges, um, but at the same time, they can inform each other. You know, I think when I play with Wilco, then I'm thinking a lot, a lot more than just in terms of rhythm, or just like laying down a beat. I'm thinking in terms of like colors and textures and how I can add stuff like that. And I'm sure being a rock drummer definitely influences 
my writing too, you know. I can name a lot of pieces that maybe have a little more rhythmic energy and they're more about rhythm um, than anything else at its core, um, exploring different ideas and questions I have about rhythm. Because, uh, you know, I've put so much time and work into these pieces over the years to write them and get them performed and, and get them recorded. With this record coming out, I have a sense of relief. This definitely shows that, uh, that growth in me and kind of this new role, not just a drummer or a percussionist anymore, but this new role as, as a composer as well. 